Welcome back, everybody, to the Pokemon Yellow Nuzlocke. This is episode 8, and today we are finally going to be able to take on Lieutenant Surge. Here is the team. We have Nubbin the Diglett at level 25, Big Mouth the Gyarados at level 25, Brenna Charmeleon at level 24, Cheeks the Pikachu, obviously, at level 26, and then Beezle the Drowsy at level 25. So our first test for today is to go ahead and withdraw a grass Pokemon so we can cut the tree. Can't click on the object to cut it? Wow, okay. Tree gone, and let's get into the gym. All right, this is the most frustrating puzzle ever. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and just battle all of the trainers and then we will work out the puzzle separately. Uh, I'll probably cut around that and then on to Lieutenant Surge. Come on sailor, what do you have for me? Better be electric. Thank you, Magnemite. It's gonna be easy for our nubbin here. Sonic Boom. Oh man, the hacks in this gym are real. And Magnemite goes down in one hit. Love to see it. 457 and we take out the sailor. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. All right. Are you an engineer? You're a rocker. So Voltorb has both Sonic Boom and Self-Destruct. So he is, I think, the thing I'm most afraid of in this gym. Voltorb again, all right. Just keep knocking him down. And I kept everybody at level 25 because I didn't want to overlevel while we were taking on these trainers. I couldn't remember how many of them there were or what their levels were. Uh, but it looks like we're going to be fine. Uh, I don't think any of the Pokemon I have are going to level past 28. Will I be able to outspeed the Raichu though? That is the question. Fry. 500. And whoa, we have an evolution. All right, Nubbin is evolving. I didn't think he evolved until level 28, but I will take a Dugtrio. All right, Nubbin the Dugtrio. So now we should be able to outspeed Raichu. Gentlemen, as Voltorb, okay. Level 22. We definitely outspeed this, that's good. We're just gonna dig. Bam. All right. Super effective. And we are just running through this gym at this rate. We might be able to even grab another encounter and get all the way to the, I think, Dark Tunnel is what it's called. So we'll shoot for that. We have taken no damage so far and taken out all the trainers. This gym is probably going to be a little bit easier than I foresaw. Yes! Finally, okay, so that didn't take too awful long, uh, but we have opened the second electric lock and we are free to move on to Lieutenant Surge in pursuit of our third gym badge. Ten Hut, welcome to Vermilion Gym. Will you look at that, a pint-sized challenger. Ha ha ha, you've got big and brassy nerves to take me on with your puny power. Pokemon battle is war and I'll show you, civilian. I'll shock you into surrender. All right, we have the Raichu. Scary. I mean, it's your only Pokemon, but it's still scary. Dig, we do outspeed the Raichu. That's really great for us. Well, we don't now. Every time I say something, it turns out to not be the case anymore. Dig. All right, and we one-shot the Raichu. All right, well, that was super, super easy. Okay, Lieutenant Surge. Feel my power. Whoa! Indeed. You're the real deal, kid. Did his voice change? So we have the Thunder Badge. All right, so now that we're done with Lieutenant Surge and the Vermilion City Gym, uh, let's just go into some of these houses and make sure we talk to everybody in Vermilion before we head out. Oh, Pikachu has found a friend, it would appear. Aw, Pikachu's in love. How adorable. Thanks for hearing me out. I want you to have this. 
A bike voucher! Oh yes, that's gonna be so helpful, I don't have to just walk around anymore. Alright. So we'll add that to the to-do list. Alright, come on Pikachu. Yes, you're in love, I know. She's just gonna break your heart though, come on buddy. Alright, you have the Thunder Badge. Yes I do! I am a good trainer! I just caught a Squirtle! I was always getting into mischief. Yes, I will absolutely take care of it. Thank you for the Squirtle. Alright, Suds the Squirtle, welcome to the squad. Alright, here is our new look team for the moment. We have Nubbin, Brenna, Cheeks, Beezle, Suds joins the squad, and Monster, our HM slave. So we did decide to put Gyarados in the box. Already at level 25, we'll be able to train him up a little bit easier uh, as we progress in the game. Uh, but for right now, we definitely need to get Suds some experience. But actually, let's just fight all the Diglett. What's it gonna hurt? It's just experience for Suds. First Diglett, level 18, all right. So, <laughs> oh, the back sprites in this game. I made it all the way through Diglett's tunnel with only one encounter. Strange, rock tunnel, there it is, not dark tunnel. Now the question is, will we be able to get Flash? Doubt it. I have 19, all right, so we get Flash. It means we don't have to slog our way through the rock tunnel. We'll be able to actually see where we're going. But I have an experiment that I have to try out. Uh, so we're not gonna teach Flash to anybody at the moment. And we have one more little errand we need to do while we're still here in Pewter City. A resurrected Pokemon, you say? Yes, I will take that. And we get the old Amber. So that means we are going to have an Aerodactyl later on in the game. I really love Aerodactyl. I loved him in the anime, and I'm very excited to use him later on in this playthrough. Whoa, we got a Doug Trio. A level 29 Doug Trio. That's actually really terrifying. But, oh god, do we even try? Hmm. Go Beezle. Alright, we're gonna try to take out this Doug Trio. Sand attacks us, okay. Can we hit the Hypnosis? No. Alright, we're gonna keep trying Hypnosis. Hopefully, he's not strong enough to one shot us. Scary, 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 scary. No! <laughs> he crits us and Beezle dies. So. Oh, we're just gonna abandon this F. Oh, shit. Uh. Cheeks? Run. Alright. So we are back and we are here in Cerulean City. And of course, we have a few little errands that we can do here before we move on to our next encounter. So we are going to turn over the bike voucher and grab ourselves a bike. The most useful item in this game. Is there a way that you can register the bike in this game? Nope. You just have to go in and select it. Okay. And our second task is going to be to retrieve our Jigglypuff. So I deposited Jigglypuff uh, before we entered Vermilion City. And... Let's see... She's grown by 21 levels, so now I have a level 24 Jigglypuff. Yes, I will absolutely take her back. Thank you. Save me a lot of grinding time. And what moves has Jigglypuff learned? We have Pound, Disable, Defense Curl, and Double Slap. Alright. Not bad. Not bad. Somehow it doesn't know Sing. That's not great. We have arrived at Route 9. So this is going to be a new area for us. A brand new encounter. So let's not waste any time. We have our first trainer battle here. There are quite a few on this route as well. We have a junior trainer, not a lass. 
Good thing I didn't try to call that out. So she has a level 18 Oddish. Certainly gonna have to get out of here with suds, but we have an answer in Brenna. Now why did I growl? Ugh. The impatience. The impatient thumbs. This Oddish is being super frustrating. Paralyzing. Ugh. Okay. The Oddish finally goes down. We get a crit now, of course. Alright, Sud's up to level 13, growing quickly. Love to see it. Alright, and Bellsprout comes in. No growth. There it is. Damn it. See, every time I say something, I just put it out into the universe. The unkillable Bellsprout, everybody. Look at that. Right. I'm just gonna go ahead and use the Paralyze Heal. At least it doesn't outspeed now. But it poisons us. Great. Another Oddish. We definitely need to invest in some more antidotes. Hopefully Cerulean sells them. Were grass Pokemon just busted in Gen 1? It seems like they were. All the status effects and the immobilization techniques. Alright, so this thing's just gonna growth, I think. We're just gonna go back into suds, try to get Squirtle as much experience as we can. And goes for the wrap, okay. Squirtle survives that one and is gonna get some nice experience. And growth. Yep, here it so it begins. And Bellsprout goes down. We get TM30 down in the corner. And TM30 is... Teleport. A teleport TM? That seems pretty useless. Okay, anyways, we have another battle. Alright, you big burly person, you. What do you have? Level fodder for the Squirtle? Geodudes? Or Machops? Level 20 Machops. We don't love to see it. I'll just go Brenna. Why not? Could use the levels. No crits on either Karate Chop. Strange. Strange. Now we get a crit. <laughs> Onyx, okay. E mm. I'm a little afraid of a level 20 Onyx, I won't lie. Let's just leer and see what he's gonna do. Why am I afraid? What am I doing? Ugh. Alright, I just need to go into Nubbin. Nubbin is the answer. Rock throw, ha 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 ha. No. Just gonna dig and make quick work of you. Bam. Goodbye. Alright, Hiker goes down. Keep it coming, hey! Yeah, I'm I'm not gonna do these voices. <laughs> Only one more trainer in between us and our encounter. We have a youngster and oh, not a Rattata, but a Sand Shrew. Alright. Level 24. Go into our own ground type here. <laughs> the name Nubbin makes me smile every time I see it. Slash is not fun. Let's see if we can hit a dig. And we do! Alright, good damage. Oh! The, no, 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 no. No, no. No, 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 no. No fissure. That's gonna be a thing in this game. No! Okay. Ah. Uh. Ah! Uh. Okay. Heart rate drastically increased very quickly. I thought he was the last one. A Beedrill, all right. Level 19 Beedrill, we're starting to see some evolved Pokemon. Even though it is just a bug, still evolves. Go into Brenna. I will keep the question of the day thing going. Uh, so today's question of the day is going to be, what is your favorite bug Pokemon? 
I'm not a huge question of the day person, but you know, why not? It gives me a chance to interact with people and I will take every opportunity I can to do that. The goal here is to build a community and I want to learn as much as I can about my community. So yeah, feel free to drop your answer in the comments below. I don't know that I have a favorite bug type Pokemon, but if I can think of one, I will just pin it in the comments for you guys. Oh, Brenna is already out. What am I doing? Oh yeah, I was going to switch back into Suds just to get the experience. Gonna focus energy. Alright, that means he's going to crit. That's scary. Just to be safe, we'll heal up. So we're going to Ember and knock out this Beedrill. 321. Oh, subs to level 16, so we are going to see that evolution in today's video. You're welcome. Here we go, Squirtle Squad! And we get ourselves a War Turtle. Hell yes, I've always loved War Turtle. And our encounter on Route 9 is going to be a... Rattata. So underwhelming. Never mind, it's going to be a male Nidoran! That's great news, because Nido King is an absolute monster. I love Nido King, and this should be a pretty good, easy encounter for us. Should be able to just start throwing Pokeballs right now, and catch it without much issue. Nidoran, welcome to the team. Love the color of the Pokeball. I wish it was actually that color. Zilla, a pretty obvious reference, but I think it's pretty fitting. So Zilla, welcome to the team. So I've decided to wrap up right here, guys, just in the interest of time. Uh, I've come back to Cerulean City to add Zilla to the squad, as you can see here. And that's going to do it for today's video. Next time we will make our way up to and maybe even through Rock Tunnel. If you guys are enjoying the content so far, make sure to destroy that like button for me. And go ahead and click subscribe and make sure you click the little bell as well so you don't miss any of the future content. This Nuzlocke is picking up in intensity pretty quickly and it's only going to get better from here on out. Well until next time, take it easy.